What's up, everybody? I'm the Brendan Skyclad, and welcome back to another episode of Spirit Bearer Farewell Edition. You're hungry. I'm gonna feed you. So, last episode. Well, Atul and Astrid aren't happy here anymore. And Atul wants to give a big family dinner feast, so that's what I'm gonna do. Alex, that. No! <laughs> you really thought you, you could actually travel this time and I did you! <laughs> Darn it, Alex, you tricked me! Should've been faster! Wait, wait! Fair enough. <sighs> Right. Gustav, let me feed you, my friend. Um. It's interesting how he won't take sweets, yeah, he'll take... <laughs> Everybody loves blueberries. Blueberries are, blueberries are good, but... Uh, they go hand in hand with, you know, certain kinds. Hi! Dude, boogie, boogie, boogie! Wait! <laughs> so, Astrid! How do you want our next D&D session to go? Hmm. I'll have to rain check on with you on that. Oh! Okay! I'll have to find the I'll have to create a character for you if you want. No, no, it's it's quite all right. I appreciate the sentiment. Oh. Oh. I'm about to be eating up all my stuff. Him and the sheep. Alright, so I was trying to gather up ingredients for uh, a tool's dinner feast last episode, but Beverly kind of took over the show. She started going on and on about all her memory, about all her, everything about herself and uh, her past. So, kind of got sidetracked with that a little bit. Are you hungry? Yes. up here at the kitchen. <laughs> you will not touch my food, my crops. <laughs> Alright, let's begin on that. <laughs> Good morning! I forgot that she easy. Oh. Good god, her dom is annoying. Nine, hang on. I have I have a bit of an issue with chewing with my mouth open sometimes. Not on purpose or anything, but it's like I just start eating and I I kinda don't realize that I'm doing it. I try to keep my mouth shut. But it's not, it, it, it's not always effective. I actually forgot that there was a Theodore on this island here. For the life of me, I honestly... Beverly, what are you doing here? Oh. Isn't this so relaxing? I could sit here for hours. Oh. Hmm. Okay. Be happy. I don't think there's anything here in Ferrogawa that I really need other than Theodore's stuff. 
Lost at sea. For your most uh, esteemed purchase, traveler. Yeah, yeah. Damn it. Okay, I already got that. This is fun. That, wait a minute, I'm, I'm starting to realize something that that that's owl statues might just be Hades. So Hades is also kind of in that shape of form. So do people like create the um, Hades statues? Do they have a belief in Hades? You got more errands for me, eh? <laughs> Francis. More treasure maps. Oh, wait. I didn't get that. So, copper and iron. Did you not eat? You can never pass up some pup food. He always finds some space. All right, I want to see what this creates. Fish sticks. Ooh, fish sticks are good, especially with um. Fish sticks are good, especially with. Tartar sauce. That's what the word I was looking for. I don't remember what's what. But I want that I want that treasure map. Iron and copper. So I need three and one. Three copper, one iron. Darn. That was way off. Work is really oh, not paying attention. <laughs> it may be tedious, but hey, the grind is worth it. I should get that treasure map. Oh. I gotta remember to pay attention. Sometimes I kind of just space out and I'll lose track of what I'm doing and then mess up and I'll have to do everything all over again.
All right, Francis, give me that treasure, man. <sighs> Next time. How do I keep forgetting what I'm have what I have to make? Be fun, Doom. I don't remember what this made. All right, next time, Francis. Darn, how come I how come I always get it wrong? always get it wrong somehow. That's not cool. Back in here again, huh? Hold up. We're stopping for a minute. Feel like it goes any faster. Sawmill. Okay, that's upgraded. I still gotta find everything else. Five. Well, I can bring Beverly's home at least. There we go. All right, I'll be back, you guys. I gotta go. Find, I gotta go talk to Susan. Cause Susan's just uh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Still nothing on 
than that. Uh, uh -huh. Still missing one. Finished. Ooh. Mm -hmm. You're halfway. You're halfway to oh. smell my mind into mush oh. with all these ingots. Take this and go. Uh, uh, uh. I can't think with you in front of me. Large clean bottle. Oh, the smithy upgrade. Mm -hmm. Look at you. You're still making dishes. Good for you. Mm -hmm. You should never give up. Even when people say you were bad at it. And believe me, people are talking about your bad cooking. Mm -hmm. Bye. Some honey, huh? Mm -hmm. Eshe's outfit. Eshe, Eshe. That name rings a bell. Is it someone Beverly knows? Hmm, interesting. So what did I make this time? Creme brulee. Ooh, I've never had cream creme brulee, but I bet it's good. All right, let's sing this. Write a little bit of song here. Cause I I want rice. It's been such a long time, hasn't it? This makes me re uh, think of summer. Summer was such a sweetheart. She definitely had a lot of lessons to teach me. I don't think I can really focus. There we go. Hey. There, just in case the sheep decide to come back. Need more coffee beans. No, I don't think it was that far down. Oh, rice, rice flower in fire glow. Got it. What can I say about summer, though? Um, from the way summer talks, it sounded like she had a um. It sounded like summer had a friend who. Always kept her in check, I guess. I don't know. Mm, I guess, in a way, I can talk about, uh. what Summer believed in. You know, all the stones and whatnot. Like, I'm. I I've never been quite a big believer in uh, all those stone abilities. Uh 
How scream with this sound? Nom, nom. Nom. Rice flour. Fire glow. Here we go. Taste exotic food, sugary food, anything fried. So I gotta find something that he will like. Oops. Ah. Right, you're good. You're good. How long do I have to wait? Not much longer. Beverly, you gotta find out what she likes. Uh, I always like the words old and fashioned, sweet pea. Something old is refined and wise. You know, I had a feeling she like would like something like that. She just, she just gave that vibe. Something fashionable was cutting edge. That's what I want out of my meals. I'll be enjoying this old-fashioned meal. Yum, 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 yum. Hey! Why oh, that noise? That's irritating. <laughs> Davido, you keep tricking me. the spice is right it smells amazing all right let me give it a try my stomach is basically a hot pepper at this point I can handle it well hang on now little <laughs> soup oh Okay, I found pretty much everything. Plain food. Fine dining food. What about... <laughs> Sugary food. Okay, so... Mm -hmm. <laughs> I can't tell where you, any of you guys are. Hey! How's it going there, buckaroo? Oh! oh. Hello! Yeah. Yeah. Pleasure to meet you. I don't... Have we met? Maybe once before. I don't remember. Yeah, it's nice to meet you. What else was there? Noodle soup. That's right.
Rice flour. Ah. Eh, probably experience up. I should get that's, that's kind of cool that Everlight becomes a uh, milk pail. Alright, now the cow has to sleep. Oh, this is what happens when I'm lost at sea and I don't know where I'm going. Ha! That's funny. Nice. My own little deck chair. Yay, snacks! I have basically nothing more than to just wait on the wheat to flower to finish. Yeah, I've pretty much just slid everywhere around the sea so far. I can't go into the mist until I can get the rest of this cleared up. An ash log. Sun springs clear. There's mystery still there. Should probably go there. And there's still one thing missing, so is that to consider as well. So I guess at this point I'm just waiting for the windmill to finish. Continue upgrading Beverly's um, house. Oh, I need ectoplasma. Okay, never mind on that. Yeah, this works. I can finish up getting their house. Oh yeah. 
Perfect. I kind of like this. This is cool. I, I always love new, uh, new things. Smash. Smash. And done. I wonder how long it takes for this thing to finish. There we go, fully improved Bruce and Mickey's crib. Nice. Yep, get in here. Where is it? Go to get in here. Yep. Mickey loves it. This is exactly up his alley. Don't tell him this, but he wanted to upstage Romeo. You wouldn't know him. He's this guy from the South Shore. He has expensive taste. He has this awful mansion. He would boast around town about his house. Mickey hated him. Listen, you've been doing enough running around. We should go somewhere. Take you out and relax a bit. Let me ask Mickey and think of something. Okay, nice. Last bit. Maybe I had an idea. Hey. Apparently, there's this place called Grey Mist Peaks. It shouldn't be far from here. Mickey thinks you're. Hey. Well, we both think you're doing a decent job. Listen, hey. we've been asking a lot from you. Well, nice to know that you guys are starting to warm up. Consider this our treat. Hey. A little camping trip for your efforts. Some recognition for your discretion and affairs. You've never actually been camping. But we would do this as a gift for you. Let's go take a look at some rocks and trees and shit. Grey Mist Peaks. I've done a lot of camping. It reminds me of the times that I've gone, I've done, I've gone camping. Ain't no sheep getting in my wheat. Ah, okay, to a tool. Hey, a tool! Got some stuff for you. Oh! Alexa. Whoa! Alexa! That sure loves her food with a little kick. Why does it put me all the way there? Noodle soup. Soup! Yeah. Way to go, Astrid. And... Tuna tataki. Yeah. The finer taste of Gustav always shine in his food choices. Just need a place to eat now. I don't think the deck is the right place for a five course meal. What about the big city, Hummingbird? Oh. That island with the shrine and the nice tables. Nothing too fancy, but still a night on the town. I'll make us a nice spot. Oh. Let's head over there. I don't know. Well, getting to have some dinner. 
is a nice little family outing. Just wish that we had some other four members with us. direction just make it faster you know that would take all day if I were to oh yeah it, it would take all day if I were to just uh, travel Again, I see. Yes. <laughs> onward, onward, Hummingbird. Wait, how do you know I'm going to Hummingbird? I know all, Stella. Don't think you can escape me. That rice is mine. Oh. Alright, let's go Hummingbird! Alright, I got a few, I got some sheep to feed. I'm gonna run out of cherry soon. Hey, Gustav, how you doing? Oh, I'm doing quite well, Atul. And how are you? Ah, oh, you know me. I'm always doing spectacular. Oh. I heard that you have a dinner planned for us. Yep, that's right. Oh, this is going to be quite interesting. Definitely. I don't remember if Gustav and Atul ever actually got a chance to talk before it. Maybe I did, maybe I didn't. It's been a while. You're not going hunger on my watch. Should see sheep get hungry fast. I keep hitting escape because I want to exit from this place, but that's not the case. Look at that, everyone's together. Sprout! Atul, Astrid, Beverly, and Gustav. Oh, well, I must say, hello there. Don't think I met you yet. Ah, oh, hello. Pleasure to meet you. Oh. I'm Beverly, and I am Gustav. This looks great. Yeah. I knew you would pull, pull through, and everyone made it. Oh. Are you ready to eat? All right, let's oh. do it. Thank you so much for being gathered here. We're missing a few. Uh, we're missing Buck. We're missing Bruce and Mickey. Yeah. I don't want those two on my ship. Uh oh, uh, here, but, uh, Buck, well, I guess he didn't want to come. <laughs> I couldn't have done it all alone. This feels like a real family dinner. Oh. You've all made me feel part of your family. Aww. Thank you. My pet better. Of course. And of course, Stella, my niece, thank you. Oh. All right, I'll stop talking now. Just dig in. Oh. Aw, oh, that was nice. Mm. 
Oh, oh great. I have to deal with this. <laughs> Gustav's just staring down at the small figure of Beverly. And he's like, What is this monstrosity? <laughs> I guess it's time. <laughs> Uncle's gone. <sighs> what? Hold the phone. What do you mean my uncle's gone? Uncle a two? Uncle Latou! <laughs> Ask Beverly, Gustav, and Astrid. Where the heck? Where did my uncle go? Gustav, where's my uncle? Uh -huh. You can taste, no, feel the rich flavors. Quite the exotic palette, Skipper. Uh -huh. My time is quite valuable. However, I've noticed that a passenger is missing. Yeah, where's our tool? What was his name? Uh -huh. That bombastic friend of yours. I don't quite we think we've ever met. Oh well. This is an outrage. How can he just be gone? Hold the phone, I need to wake everybody up. Everybody, where is my uncle? Where's Uncle Latool? Good morning! Astrid! Mm -hmm. mm. Where's the tool? A tool? Indeed. I wonder where he might be. I don't know why, Munchkin. But I have a hunch you... He won't be back? Mm -hmm. And that makes me sad. He's always been so joyful. And funny. Mm -hmm. Oh, but I won't miss him snoring for sure. Sorry I couldn't be able to help, Stella. He's gone? Just left? Bro! Bro, no! No! What? A tool? You could've just... You can't leave me like this! That's 
not fair! I wanted to give Uncle Toad a proper send-off! No! to me This is hurt. This hurts. Yeah. I'm sorry. I can't believe he's gone. No, I'm not. My family's leaving. First Gwen, then Summer, then Alice and Giovanni. Now Tool. And... Even you. Hmm. I know it must be hard, Munchkin, but... Time waits for no one. We can only do so much with our lives. Live to the fullest, just like Giovanni. So I, I see you've made that decision finally. Yeah. It's really not going to be easy. I really wanted to give a two a proper send off, you know. Mm. Perhaps he had his reasons for leaving, Munchkin. Yeah, probably. this and then the Astrid? Mm -hmm. What's that? I honestly didn't know what to think of you when we first met, but I've really grown to come to care for you. <laughs> I appreciate that. Alright, Astrid, one last... Here's one last final thunderstorm for you. Make it 
count, Stella. I could buy the Astrid, but a tool leaving tomb. Well, much can. It's your job, isn't it, as a spirit fair? I really think Gwen would agree with that. Anyway. We're just about there, so... Do your thing. Alright. Everyone's... <sighs> so hard letting go, people that you love. Long, Astrid. Farewell, Gustav. Hmm. Um. I'm going to entrust you to take a tool's place from now on and be there for Stella. You and Buck. Of course. It's been a pleasure. Ne. Later, you. Goodbye. Well, I can't say for certain that I that I've come to appreciate the two of you. But I suppose that's all I can really say. Yeah, best for you. Goodbye, dear. Goodbye, there. I'm glad we had the chance to really. I'm glad we had the chance to meet. Yes, me too. I'm gonna need it. 
Goodbye, Astrid! So long, Buck. Hey. I would have really liked to go on to your roleplay yeah. adventures. It would have been a fun time, that's for sure. <laughs> Quite. <laughs> one last mm -hmm. one, Astrid. Does this have to happen? I've lost two. I've lost two of my family members in, in one episode. Mm -hmm. I don't think it's wise to live that long, Munchkin. You know, I actually would agree with her. There's only so much living you can do before you just get tired of it all. Good thing I've never been that wise. But boy, <laughs> am I old. <laughs> I can relate. I think a lot of people can relate at this point. Mm -hmm. And being this old is disappointing. Oh? You just end up being ugly on the outside. And rotten on the inside. Mm -hmm. And it hurts so much. Life is suffering. It is hard. Mm -hmm. The world is cursed. But still, you find reasons to keep on living. No... No words... Could be no true words could be spoken, Astrid. Mm -hmm. I don't regret a thing, you know. I don't regret the struggles. I don't regret the hardships. Mm -hmm. The pain. The sorrow. And I've seen so much of it. Mm -hmm. But still, I don't regret what I've done or how I've lived my life. I just wish the world had been a better place. Yeah. Honestly, Astrid, yeah. I honestly wish the world could be better. So full of selfish people nowadays. People who just want the greed. Most of them for no reason. Just to ruin other people's lives, you know? Mm hmm. I've heard a place for them. For us. But surely, a better place for you. My dear. Mm -hmm. I feel like a vast vessel. With so many dusty rooms and cabins. I have so many of them. So many memories. Mm -hmm. Some of them are gone. But some of them, some of them will live on forever. In you, and others. Mm -hmm. I remember their faces as they trembled in fear. I remember their houses and the parties they threw. I remember their songs and their love. Mm -hmm. I remember their touch, their warmth. It's all fading away now, Munchkin. Astrid. It's fading away. 
Mm hmm It's all grey. All white. All foggy. see much anymore. You're still here with me. Oh no! Yes. <laughs> Can you really not see anything anymore? Mm -hmm. You're still here, still. Oh my gosh! The hurts. The hurts so much. Okay, that one broke me! Don't you forget about me, please. I don't care about anyone else. <laughs> I was good up until just now. Mm -hmm. But you... You don't forget about me. I'm telling you. <laughs> I'll come back and haunt you if you do. Mm hmm I can feel it coming. <laughs> Goodbye, Stella. Just follow your heart. <laughs> it keeps smiling. Hmm. Hmm. Not so wise. She's the wisest. Oh. <laughs> I never thought Astro would be so wise to bring out two words. so much crying over the past few s spirits but they still so hold some impact on my heart <laughs> oh Astrid I always be with you I didn't really think they would get me. Oh, <laughs> oh just the fact that she was, that she could she just couldn't see anymore. Go get ectoplasma. <laughs> Hold on a minute. No, no, I gotta go back. I just read up on sending. <laughs> something that I felt to have taken notice before. Because I didn't I didn't find did the fall in accordance. Alright, 
All you sheep are fed. <laughs> I'm now down to four again. All, right, all you guys are good. wherever the little marker thing is. It was wild. Hey. We had ten, we had to blast. Make you making so much money. The money. Hey. There was nothing we couldn't buy. Our mom had never seen so much dough. She was a great lady. Hey. Stuck in her old ways. She knew Mickey was putting himself in danger. But she didn't say anything since the house was painted twice over. <laughs> Everything's like unimmune. Okay, so I'm missing some stuff. Seventeen thousand, huh? Alright, well, you know what? I think this is a good place to call this episode for right now. Both the tool and Astrid are gone now. A tool I wasn't expecting his to never to re I, I wasn't expecting him to never return. Why do you do this to me, game? Why do you take away everybody I love? Well, anyway. I hope everyone had a good, uh, I hope everyone enjoyed this episode. Uh, if you did, please like, comment, and share. And don't forget to subscribe to see more in the future. Next episode, I gotta go fishing in that rocky place. So, I'll catch you all later.